was one initial blast and then several blasts thereafter. So it was like one hit and then several. So like an initial and then a response. Keith Wilhelm was relaxing with his family Thursday afternoon when he heard gunshots down the street. I had a baby here visiting it. It was, was a little concerned for a few minutes. Yeah. The New Hampshire Attorney General's office says a call came from 8 Joppa Road around 1220 that a man was threatening to stab his father. Two Merrimack police officers rushed to the scene and allegedly found 23-year-old Harrison Lambert standing at the end of the driveway with a knife. At that point, we know that he was armed with a knife. An altercation took place, and we know at least one officer fired. Lambert was critically injured and airlifted to Beth Israel Deaconess Hospital. Senior Assistant Attorney General Benjamin Agati says no one else was hurt. The officers right now, none of them have any sort of physical injuries. And neighbors are not in danger. No, we have no indication of any threat to the public. Uh, believes that this, in, this interaction that took place was very, very brief. Herb Mosier has lived on nearby Turkey Hill Road for more than 50 years, but he's never seen anything like this. The local boys always have their little things going on, but... Uh, no, there's been nothing malicious that I know of. But Wilhelm says the shooting doesn't make him feel less safe. No, because no matter where you are in this country, it doesn't matter. Something happens every day. Agati said that he believes that the officers involved in the shooting will be placed on paid administrative leave, but that decision is up to Merrimack Police Department. Live in Merrimack, Stephanie Woods, WMUR News 9.